of beer movement. It's a new dawn, it's a new day. It's day number four of my travels. Monday morning, I'm still uploading yesterday's video, so I'm getting that up for you. And I looked at the, the video I uploaded yesterday and I was blown away by the performance. I'll thank you guys for liking, commenting, subscribing, whatever you did. My channel kind of blew up last night. And I just doubled my subscriber count, which is fucking amazing. Thank you guys for, for doing that. I'm very, 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 very grateful for that. So I'm still waiting for the video to upload and then it's time to hit the city and see the historic parts of Fortaleza. And I'm finally out of the hostel. I had just spent half an hour dealing with the lock for my locker. <laughs> Somehow I, I open it, I put some stuff in there and I put it back on and I closed it because I went down into the lobby. And when I, wanted, when I went back up, I wanted to open my locker and get out my camera and my drone so I can get moving. It didn't open. I used the right code. I. Uh, I had some kind of emotional breakdown, <laughs> but yeah, it took me almost half an hour to figure it out and I googled how to crack these locks and blah blah blah. And in the end one number changed and Lucas, one of, one of the other guys in my hostel, came into my room. Lucas is the lucky one in Latin, if you don't know. He came in and two minutes later my lock was open. I'm, I got lucky with that and I tried getting my SIM card activated, didn't work, I need to find a local to help me out at one point. Right now I don't need a phone though, but it's rainy as tits. I don't know what to do, I'm just standing here, I don't want to get too soaked, so... Uh, waiting, waiting, waiting. Five hours later. Rain is over luckily, I decided to do some tourist stuff today, so I walked over to this big ass cathedral. It's in shitty condition, but... It's a weird area of the city, uh, some nice buildings, some completely broken down, so yeah, I can't, unfortunately can't go inside the cathedral, it's closed, but it's life. I love moisture, I usually like being in the heat, but whew, it's steamy out here today. All this rain is just making me drip in sweat. There's like this military compound around here and looks like they have some kind of ceremony going on. I've seen this from the pier before. There's this shipwreck out there, I think. I don't know what that all about, but... not to get run over. Yeah, that's the shipwreck. I don't know why it's there. They should get rid of it maybe, but it's a nice... looks like art. I'm standing at the front of an old pier which is pretty broken down. I think there was a shipyard back here maybe a few decades ago, who knows. It's a pretty nice spot, pretty quiet, but there are all these weird buildings. I don't know what they used to do here. It's a nice place though. I've been chilling for the past half hour on this pier because it was raining again. But there were two cool guys, they were fishermen. We somehow managed to speak, but they didn't speak any English. I don't speak any Portuguese yet, so difficult conversation, but it's fun. It's a night and day difference here at the beach. Yesterday there was, it, well this was completely packed with people, but today there is nothing going on. But there's still some liquor stands, but less than yesterday. Oh, it was Sunday yesterday. Right, okay, that makes sense. It's a night and day difference here. Or a weekend, weekday difference, maybe? <laughs> I just bought this. This is a coconut. I've been seeing people with coconuts in hands all over the place, but I haven't tried one yet because I didn't have cash. But now it's time to give it a taste test. Mm. 
Oh. That's a straight 10 out of 10 for me, honestly. That's a this is so refreshing. It's like water, but 10 times better, probably. I love water, though. But this? Mm. I could have this all day. Wow. So if anybody ever comes to Brazil, give coconuts a try. It's fucking amazing. Mm. That's soul food right here, honestly. It's... Wow. Wow. The shitter is going home. <laughs> this guy's just having fun with his bike at the beach. I don't know if he wants to clean it or what is going on here. Yep, he wants it cleaned. <laughs> He's going in. He's gonna get smashed by a big ass wave. There we go. <laughs> They can't move it! Ah. There we go! These things are so good I had to buy a second one, honestly. This... Oh, this is even tastier than the first one. It's more fruity. I just realized I haven't been in the water yet. It's my fourth day traveling third day in the city and I have not been in this beautiful ocean yet so time to take a dip well this was refreshing waves are strong as fuck so much fun in the water <sighs> I haven't been in the ocean for an eternity wow I just picked up some groceries I'm hungry as tits I didn't have anything since 7 30 and it's almost yeah it's almost 4 p.m. I'm starving same pickup I had last time. Just some bread, some cream cheese, an apple. But this time I have some marmalade, which is pretty neat. Whew, that meal felt good. I'm kind of full, but an apple a day. You know the rule, it keeps the doctor away. Mmm, <laughs> nice and juicy. It's a few hours later now. I'm chilling here in a hammock in the hostel. This is fucking comfortable. I've been sitting here for the past... I have no idea. I've been sitting here all evening just chilling, relaxing, kicking back, thinking about life. Yeah, yeah. Good times, good times. I love being out here. I love traveling. I love being on the road. But as I already fell asleep in this, in this hammock, I need to end this video, I need to go to bed, I need to, yeah, do something. I thank you guys for watching, I'll appreciate you subscribing, liking, commenting, do whatever you like to do, I've really, really appreciated the, the support in the recent days. And I hope you guys have a wonderful day. I'll talk to you guys in the next video, bye bye.